Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Within with me, Get Daved. We're just going to take one quick look at our barracks here. Um, we have some level, well I guess two people, but um, we could hire some more. I think I'm going to go for that very shortly. Um, you definitely want to develop more people. Uh, than just like a team of four or so. Your maximum team size, at least in Enemy Unknown, was six soldiers, which I expect to hold here. Um, yeah, which we would do with uh, these upgrades. Yeah, which are very similar to before. Can't have any of those because we don't have experienced enough soldiers. Uh, and we can hire soldiers as well. Oh, okay. Hire... Let's just hire one new soldier. And then you find out who you've got. So that's nice. You also sometimes will get soldiers as a reward for doing missions or whatever. Alright. Mission control. You'll spend a lot of time doing this. You hit scan for activity, time is going to rapidly zoom forward at this point, and uh, wait, I lied. We're going to get engineering working on a satellite. I had some time to assess the finances. Alright. Commander, our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible. To All right, we're going to save the money. Let's just go straight for it. Enough teasing to, to mission control. Hit the scan button. Time rapidly shoots forward, and you want these to go by before you see attacks. Yeah, like this. We did not get any new gear. Commander, we've picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Oh, no, Vancouver. Oh no, the World Cup. Okay, 200, four engineers, pfft. four scientists. Uh, I really like money. Depending on where we choose, panic will spread to other territories, um, and then you can lose support. Panic goes down if you help them. If I got more engineers, I could build a satellite uplink, and then I could distribute more satellites and get more money. Um, none of these are particularly close to home. Scientists, that would ra greatly increase our research speed, which is also kind of tempting. We don't really have anything to spend our money on right now. And all the missions are the same difficulty. I'm gonna go with the engineers for now um, because that's gonna be a gateway to a satellite uplink a little sooner. Um, it is not a super simple or clear choice. So there we go. Uh, Mills, hey? Yeah, sure. Come on, Shane. And Anderson, we're going to adjust his loadout here. Going to give you the med kit. Oh, that's nice. We can tab through. Alright, let's rock and roll, everybody. Oh, that is a grizzled face. I've seen aliens kill more people than you'd ever meet. Also, how fast does this thing fly? That's like Mach 5. Dropship has arrived. Give yourself 10 gig Dave points if you actually calculated the speed. Um, yeah, let's go. The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. All right. Downtown Vancouver, here we go. 
No, it appears to be an elementary school. Or an industrial yard. Strike one, this is central. You are free to engage all hostile contacts in the AO. Don't take any chances. That's the area of operation. Um... These look like they contain petroleum. I'm gonna take cover behind them. Uh, seems legit. But that back door leads to more of the facility. Oh man, and there's a roof. And we could have some trouble on our hands here. It's always tempting to play out a hunch and just like shoot something with a rocket really early on. Uh, as soon as you spot aliens, they'll um, freak out and move around. That was slightly risky, but I think we're okay. Let's go for here. If you just shoot a rocket into where you think they are, if you're correct, you can just kill them all right away. Game wants me to go this way. Well, I trust the game. It's probably safe. On the move. He's exposed over here. I really don't like that, but looks like we're going to get away with it. I'm gonna go for this. If he sees anybody, I'm gonna pull him out. We're getting a little bit spread out here, so we're just okay. gonna take it nice and easy. Running. Oh shoot, I just used running gun. Curse you, remapping of buttons. Well. Well, I was going to talk about run and gun later, but um, it. it lets you sprint and still shoot at the end. Or in this case, we can still overwatch. Boom! Yeah. <laughs> Didn't like that. Heading there now. Visual on the goods. Oh, not quite. Well, that's a pretty defensible position, assuming nobody comes from over here. Oh, goodness. Pretty wicked music. Oh, and we don't have run and gun with her anymore. Oh my goodness. It's gonna be pretty tricky to reach that. So close. Yeah, we have some problems here. Moving out. Heading there now. Uh, 
All right. Uh, I could pull back, but I'm in a little bit of a hurry. I'm fully willing to sacrifice this guy's precious resources. piece of sizzling bacon. <laughs> okay. Don't get shot. I predict that she's not really safe there. This is me sort of wagering that they're going to be more to my uh, top right than my uh, top left. Alright, there was a little crawly over there who we never did deal with. A little worried about how that's going to play out. Oops. part of the game is enjoying the tension as well. Oh good. You hear that? I think that's my friend and yours. Little fella from before. that even be? Well, On it. I'm just gonna split up my forces and have someone go check it out. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna try for this. And we'll see if she gets shot at. That's called the scientific method, everybody. Now we know there's enemies back in this direction. But I think they're so far away she should be okay. Getting a little spread out, this could be a problem. What was that sound? I love the little paranoid sounds. Also, oh boy. Yeah, we had pretty good luck on the other Overwatch. Couldn't last. Although, what I just said is actually a form of what they call probability entitlement. Basically, it's the rationale of, well, I got unlucky several times in a row, therefore I will probably be lucky this time, or okay. it should even out. Oh, you got no guarantee it'll even out. Okay, we're gonna run and gun just to give her a little bit more safety, and so that she can deactivate this right now. No, I wanna I want collect. Okay, I'll give her some very loose safety. Okay. Do I think they're gonna flank me through this door? Possibly. Here's what we're gonna do. Ideally, we would have uh, 
misses assault there, but. So that's gonna improve her visibility. All right. Just gonna put him uh, on Overwatch there. This is kind of perplexing. I don't know what I'm gonna do here. I'm assuming the alien is too far from this door to open it and shoot him, so we'll see how that assumption pays off. Um, I think that position is too exposed. So we're going to try here. Uh, and that'll get us two bad shots. Which is probably good enough. I'm going to try not to destroy the corpses here. How'd that even work? Oh well. Crap! Okay. This is trouble. So the one guy we forgot about is getting a boost from his pal. They're moving around the side. So, alright. Dave is punished for his, uh... Assumption. Eighty-four percent. I'll take those odds. Or will I? He'll be exposed on the other side. Kate. Okay. Hope no one's overwatching him. America. All right, and his gun's empty. Awesome. So if you take a look at this, this is how much ammo you have left in your gun. Typically, I'm just going to come out and call it three or four shots is what you usually have to work with. Uh, I'm going to go for this run because we've got to get her back in the engagement zone. And I suspect these guys might be it. Otherwise, that's a pretty large force for the enemy. For the enemy within. What are your aim chances like? 67%? I'll take those odds. That's basically around the corner is what the game's trying to simulate. It's just kind of drawing it weirdly. So Alien probably has those sorts of odds too. Yeah, sure. He could be in a lot of trouble right now. Walls are not perfect barriers in this game. Especially in a moment like that. That's brick. Kind of made what could be considered a mistake. Um, I could have used his med kit to maybe help someone else and that might help with recovery time. Um, I don't know the exact mechanics. It seems to help a little bit. And that's all I can say. Alright. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna try to blow up the entire side of this building. Yeah, let's see if that works. Hopefully it doesn't start a chain reaction. Alright. Switch it up. We'll have to use the pistol. Bad odds. if she can cover for him somehow.
We have a full cover position. I'm gonna try to get him out of there. Don't overwatch me! Now would be a wonderful time to have run and gun, but unfortunately we do not. Yeah, sure. She'll have one shot after this anyway, might as well. Oh my goodness. If I may, Commander, the labs are on high alert. Teams are standing by for your orders. We can begin researching the newly recovered artifacts immediately. Well, thanks, science. Okay, so panic's gonna have spread everywhere else now, so... Yay. Commander to the situation room. Commander to the situation room. We'll click through that. And Mr. Mills is wounded. Another support, though. Two kills. Well done, sir. Most units uh, will use the rifle by default. Um, assault will switch to using a shotgun, and heavies will switch to be to using um, like a, a machine gun on a on a mount. Commander to the situation room. Commander to the situation room. Thanks. Uh, and I believe the supports and. Uh, Actually, no. Basically, everybody starts using a different weapon, because the snipers will use a sniper rifle, so... But everybody can still use the rifle, and sometimes that's preferable. Seven sectoids in that, because there's the one we've blown up. Building vehicles found... Oh, wow! Commander to the situation room. Refund Commander on the okay. Room. We will be in touch, Commander. Ominous. Every member of the council is going to want satellite coverage, so we should plan our deployments carefully. Yeah. The further, whoops, the further, uh, like your fighters have to go to intercept any alien invasion that happens. You can sometimes shoot them down and stuff. It gets harder as the game goes on. Um, you have to anticipate them getting there, though, and the further they are the from a base, the less chance you have of intercepting a UFO. And have two fighters by your base at all times, or one really good one. I'm receiving you. We'll monitor that contact, but I don't think it's related to the UFO activity. Okay. Let's see what we can get. Yes, more money, because we're getting 247 per month. Ah, yes, and you get super bonuses. So USA brings a lot of money. Brazil, we kind of owe a favor since we allowed an abduction to happen there. Ditto with Australia. Nothing to report at the moment. Boards are clear. All right, so we could. Oh wow! But only seventy. Hmm. Well, if I'd thought this through a bit more in advance, I probably would have let the abduction happen in Vancouver, then put a satellite over the United States. Yeah, right, India can only kick in 60 bucks a month. Or trillion, or whatever it is. XCOMs. Yes, Mother Russia. We've been picking up some odd transmissions lately. Some nut calling himself Commander Straker has been all over the news ranting about shadow operatives. Interesting. Well... I think I'm gonna have to make the pragmatic decision for right now. Ugh. And get satellite coverage on the states.
Yeah, because, I mean, another scientist. Yeah, that's pretty nice. Alright. So, let's just uh, back out of here for a second. New soldiers arrive at XCOM HQ. To fill in for the ones that got shot up, although we got our second mission pretty quickly there. Uh, so let's just go to the hangar real quick. And we're going to have to transfer this one to North America, and hopefully nothing terrible happens while it's in transit. Uh, yeah. The interceptors are okay. Um, we'll be able to build technology to help them out in the long run. And I think I'm going to leave this one here. And the next one will probably start uh, simulating right to our next conflict. I'll see you there, everybody.